Saw the red bull there from Marlies. And outside for Cali West. So here we go with the women's finals. This is a first to five legs here for these two ladies. As is Cali West taking Mar on Marlies Keel. Marlies throwing a whopping 70.77 in her last match. Wanted to mention that one as she uh, beat out Paula Murphy. Cali West, some mentionables for her. Uh, of course, out of the Syracuse area. She's been at the top of the ADO rankings for or at least in the top 10 for 12 plus years, I think. She's been uh, quite the player. I think she's finished, finished at the top of the ADO rankings uh, numerous times. For Marlies Keel, I do not know off the top of my head where she is from. I apologize for that information. If you do know, please let us know in the chat. It's nice to have you guys as some reliable help every once in a while because I know you're going to correct me if I'm in the wrong. So let us know where she's from. Phil Freed saying Ohio, appreciate that. So Marley's from the Ohio area. She's been a good shot for quite some time too. Cosmo player. Rhonda giving the exact location. Cleveland, thank you, Rhonda. That's why I love having you guys in the chat quick to let me know if I have a question or not it's a 167 look for Cali using her signature colonial barrels from a to z darts dot com Available in uh, 23 gram steel tip as well as 20 gram soft tip. Got a nice little sharp cut on the back end with some ring grips and then a little micro cut in the front. Nice solid dart. Of course, Marlies going to her Cosmo barrels. 84 needed for Cali West here. Trip 20 in there. So double 12 in there as well. Solid two dart checkout for Cali West. Nice 20 dart leg there, 75.15 average to start here as she breaks throw in the first leg. Adjustment, so I'm not coming in too loud on you guys. Yeah. 
Ooh, Jen mentioned a good mentionable too. Callie West's new flights. Yeah, I forgot she's using those bad boys. Used to have the old Wild West flights. Now getting a new look from Fit Flight. Great stuff. A couple ladies in the background watching this match. And underneath that triple 20 there's Marlies Keel. It's a 146 look for Cali West. Really, Cali's darts are going in really smooth. Check out that setup. What a great setup for 36. Double 18 is what she leaves. I gotta tell you. Marlies has a smooth stroke, just solid looking stroke to her. Of course, you see that um, Callie West has that slight little, you know, forward, back, forward kind of routine to her. Or sorry, back, forward, back kind of routine to her before she releases. Um, where Marlies Keel is a little bit more straight to the point, sturdy, doesn't move at all all 81 for her there I'm gonna take a look at that oops just to kind of give you a look at what I'm what I'm seeing there. get the same for Callie West here in just a little bit kind of she's very sturdy as well but does have that that unique release I should say another mentionable I want to mention for Callie is that she's got a fantastic thing she's been working on in the background when she has time I know she puts a lot of uh, effort into it including hand done animations but she's got a great thing uh, like almost a dart how to or dart 101 a startup page called garage darts definitely want to check that out on YouTube some uh, fun episodes she's created there I think she's got a couple um, to start Hey, me and Jen were thinking the same thing at the same time. How about that? Boom. Solid first here for Marlies. Looking for a ton 80. She's got it. Big 180 there for Marlies Keel. That'll certainly help your cause. She pulls down to a 98. It's going to have a look at a, at a checkout. A 98 look here. Goes for the 18 for a start. Falls into the 4, but she's going to have a look here. Double top. Ooh, just underneath. Callie West taking a look at this 1, 5, 6.
six, so it's going to be double seven here. Another one of them blocker darts does look in as we heard a little clap from the crowd. It is in, so. Nice hold of throw there for Marley's keel as Callie West will step up. Both of these ladies look like they're on a mission right now. Just looking at their face, they're both really... Really, I mean, of course you're into the match, but I mean, these guys are intent. I mean, you can just tell by the way they're, they're throwing right now that they're in the form. I think Marlies would like a little bit more of an average for her, but I gotta tell you, Callie's throwing really well right now. This is anyone's game because Marlies can turn it on at any point. Like I mentioned before, throwing a 70.77 average in her last match to get here over Paula Murphy. So she is definitely capable of producing the goods if she finds form. And look at this. Ton 80 look. Yes, big 180 from Callie West. As you see her give a small fist pump as she leaves one of her favorite doubles, double 18. Here we go. She hit it in one last time. Well, it won't be one this time, but she can do it in a couple darts. And she does it with her second. A little fist pump there from her. Quality stuff as it's a 3-1 lead for Callie West. And look at that average spike to a 76.74. A really nice leg of darts there. As, hey, folks, that was a 16-dart leg. Or sorry, no, a 14 dart leg. Let me reiterate. Jen, don't worry, I will be telling Chris since I see him. Uh, I'll probably see him this weekend, so uh, expect that text from Chris Lim. <laughs> You can kind of see a little bit of a tell on uh, Callie's face as she was not quite happy with that 45 there. Gotta make a big dent here. Eesh, two tough darts there for her. 26 is not what she wanted to throw there. This gives Marlise Keel an opportunity to make this 3 2. find the triple she does big dart there for Callie West and she gives herself a look at a checkout if she gets the opportunity to and she will as Marley's keel does not hit the number she wanted how about this just checking in Mike Newbert 
tuning in to see this women's final after his final and second place finish just a little bit ago. Do you want to congratulate you, Mike, for uh, making it through to the finals, man? That's uh, no easy task, and win or lose, I mean, still got to congratulate you for a uh, good day at the Aki. 2020 for tops here. Just underneath giving Cali West a look at this 99 checkout. Rain and Tito Martinez. Hey, hope you guys are doing well. Thanks for tuning in for a little steel tip action. Something I normally uh, get the opportunity to stream with the uh, partners promoting darts program. Nice to see you here, sir or ma'am, whichever one is tuning in. Could be both. It's <laughs> a so double 10 here from Marlies. Got to overcome that dart there. Unfortunately, not getting a, a marker look. So she will give Callie West the opportunity at tops to make this a 4-1 match. Callie West right in with the double 20. Her doubles have been fantastic in this one. An impressive match average here for Cali. Really, Marlies is playing well too now. I mean, she's raised it to a 64.09. Not quite what she had in the semis, but anything can happen here. We've seen Mike Newbert come back from Jay Waugh to get into the final. Down 4 1, ended up besting Jay 5 4. Good ton there for Marley's finding the triple with a third dart. Pulls her down to 218. Really a neck and neck leg here. Callie does have the first opportunity at a checkout here, 137. Got the first dart. Going for the trip 19. Just falling a little bit short. But can still set herself up. If Marlies Keel does or is not able to finish this 88 checkout is a 21st dart here. Unfortunately falling into the five, so trip 17. And that one's outside as well, so it'll be double tops for Callie West. And I gotta tell you folks, she has not missed much as it's gonna be a possible 19 dart leg to win the title. Inside, double 10. Takes just a second of hesitation. I think she would like that one back. Maybe just a little bit of nerves there. 64 needed. 16-16 for double 16. Inside for Keel. 
48 scored. West will get another opportunity here. Double 10 for the win. Oof. Ooh, just falling inside, giving the look back to Keel. Double eight, and it's in there right in the corner of that, that bed as she breaks Callie West's throw. Yeah, Callie just slightly mishap there. She steps back around the Aki as Keel did break throw, so she's going to get the opportunity to hold here. Lucas Hens, thanks so much for the 30 stars. We appreciate it. Once again, folks, if you haven't gave us a like and follow here on Facebook or subscribe to our YouTube page, definitely do so. Lots of action coming your way, including the Las Vegas Open tomorrow and Sunday, as well as a, a packed full year here. Yeah, that's right. We've got a ton of events coming your way this year. I think six or seven possibly eight already booked and I gotta tell you folks we are always looking for more so if uh, you're you've got a tournament that you'd like to be streamed reach out to us www.usadarts.live or uh, hit us up on uh, Facebook Solid third, pulling a ton. Those are difficult darts there for Keel. She did not want to see those ones, but does get the third dart triple to make it a 64 shot. But a couple big triples here for Callie will put her in a good spot. Dylan Foley, wow, 490 stars. Appreciate that, sir. Hope you're doing well. Lewis Coates turning in from the UK. Hope you're doing well, buddy. Thanks for joining us. 239 needed for Cali West. Advantage to Keel, sitting on a checkout of 143. Cali does find that big triple for an 85, though, to guarantee a look. That sometimes all you need is just that opportunity. And you never know, it could fall in. So 154 needed for West. Three uh, singles there for a 60. 100 needed for Marlies Keel. She's not going to have the opportunity now. Missing the triple with her second dart. Gonna was hoping for that double 10 look. So, Wes, let's see if she goes bowl or double eight or triple 18. Looks like she's going the triple 18 route. She is. So that'll make 76. Missing the. Uh, Trip 20 just on the low side. So set herself up for 40 if she gets the opportunity to come back. Keel for tops. Ooh, tough dart there. Falling into the six, leaving herself double 14. Or sorry, double seven. My apologies. And look at that. Big darts there for Callie West as she manages to win the 501 ADO National Championship. Congrats to her. That will be her second title for 01. And look at that. The ladies supporting these ladies. That's that's great to see right there. Uh, 
as we see a little celebration there as Matt Stoner from the ADO, the vice president, steps in to give her a little uh, love. Well, I tell you what, we're going to do this one automatically since we forgot it last time. And uh, I'm going to hop out there and maybe get a, uh, these pictures as well as maybe do an interview with Callie. So hold on one second, folks. Right up here. Right up here. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit, huh? A little yeah, emotional. Yeah, it was, it was, it was tough. It yeah. Was a hard fought I day, tell you, you know? I, I tell I, you what. I tell you what. Have you been for how long now? Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm here uh, with Callie West, of course, two-time 01 national championship now. How does that feel? Yeah, uh, it's amazing. I, To be honest, I think the other time I won it was against Marlies as well, oh, which is wow. uh, pretty ironic, but... Uh, yeah, no, she's a great, great shooter. I have so much respect for her. And, uh, you know, I just knew I had to bring my best game to, you know, to, to keep up with her because she's an amazing scorer. And, you know, she can bring it down so fast. I just knew I had to keep up with her, you know. And that's the thing. She's, she's, she's been doing it for a while. And a lot of these ladies, there's a handful of ladies that you guys have been around the scene for some time. Yeah. You've battled it out numerous of times. Yeah. And, you know. Just for yourself, you've been at the top of the ADO rankings for years, and just to solidify a second national title underneath your belt is, is yes. really something. You can tell you a little <laughs> a little emotional. Absolutely, and I got absolutely. I got what we play for, you know. You, you did it in style too. I mean, you you, you were shooting seventies there. I don't know if <laughs> wow. you knew that or no, not. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> it was just. Your doubles were impeccable. You hit yeah. that double 18 numerous times, and your double yeah. tops were yeah. impressive. So Yeah, thanks. Yeah, yeah. They, they didn't let me down today. You know, it was just uh, everything was just flowing, and, uh, you know, it worked out. Uh, uh, just just real happy when you can get that kind of focus and bring that focus in to actually, uh, you know, play the darts you know you're capable of. You exactly. Know? Yeah. Exactly. And that's yeah. what it is, is putting it all together yeah. when you need to. Exactly. Uh, you know, it's yeah. not always going to be that way, but right. when, it, when it does, it feels, <laughs> it feels really good. Really great. Yeah. And it'll yeah. set you up for the weekend. That's nice. So yeah. tomorrow yeah, and Sunday will be good. Hopefully yeah. you can continue on. But, yeah, uh, yeah. Thank you. Congrats yeah. again, Callie. So Thanks happy again, for Will. you. Thank you so Appreciate much. It. Thank you. Take Thank care. Thank you yeah. so much for what you for do. For sure. Yeah. Appreciate it. All right.